Hello my dear all viewers, today I will show the follow thorough principle of 3D animation. Here I use a tail rig. This rig is absolutely free. You can download easily from Google. Also I will give you the download link in my description. So let's go how to apply follow thorough principle in tail animation. First go to the Maya, open the tail rig file. Now I customize the material color a little bit. Here I decrease the specular value. Turn off all the object selection, then turn on only curve selection. Because when we make animation, we don't need bones, mesh and other selection. Select the master control. I rotate this rig because I make this animation in front view so that we can easily understand the flow through process. Before start animation, see at a glance the pixel. Here I try to give a clear concept about the rig part. Here in the same time tail leading part will flow the body part but tail follower one will follow the tail leading part few frame letters like 3 or 5 frame. Also tail follower 2 3 will follow the tail follower 1 few frame letter. So let's start the animation. Here I make this animation 1 to 80 frames. Select all the rig controls, then press S key from keyboard, then go to the 15 frames, also press S key and continue press S key in 30, 40, 50, 65 and 80 frames. Select the body control in 15 frames. I rotate the y axis minus 20. Then go the 30 frames. I rotate the y axis plus 20. Then go the uh, 40 frame. Rotate minus 10. Then frame 50. Rotate plus 10. Then frame 65, rotate minus 5, then frame 80, rotate plus 5. Now select the tail leading control with other tail controls in 15 frame. Also follow the body control in the same rotation. So these are rotated in y axis minus 30. Then go the 30 frames. Here these are rotated in y axis plus 30. Then go the 40 frames. Rotate minus 30. In 50 frames. Rotate a plus 30. In 65 frames, rotate to minus 30. In 80 frames, rotate to plus 30. Still select the old tail control. Now in 20 frames, that means 5 frame later, we deselect the tail leading control. Rotate this 3 tail follower controller in y axis minus 40. Then 5 frame later, in 25 frames, Deselect the tail follower 1 control, then rotate this tail follower 2 3 controller in y axis minus 40. We apply this process in every rotation step. Now move the time slider in 5 frame. Here I select this 3 controller and rotate 
follow the tail leading controller rotation in frame 10 that means 5 frame later we select these two controller and rotate follow the tail follower one controller rotation in frame 33 we select these three controller and rotate follow the tail leading controller rotation in frame 37 we select these two controller and rotate follow the tail follower one controller rotation in frame 43 we select this three controller and rotate follow the tail leading controller rotation in frame 47 we select these two controller and rotate the tail follower one controller rotation in frame 55 we select this three controller and rotate follow the tail leading controller rotation in frame 60 we select these two controller and rotate the tail follower one controller rotation In frame 70, we select this three controller and rotate, follow the tail leading controller rotation. In frame 75, we select this two controller and rotate, follow the tail follower one controller rotation. Now see this tail movement. Now I apply easy in, easy out in every controller rotation car. Now select the body controller, go to the graph editor, select Y rotation curve in frame 5, right click insert key, then select this key, hold middle mouse button, then move this key upward for easy in. In frame 26, right click insert key, then select this key, move upward for easy out. In frame 75, insert key move this key upward for easy out in frame 60 right click insert key then move this key upward for easy in and also move this key a little bit i will apply this easy in easy out to all other controllers Now make some key polishing in the every rotation curve. Now hide the nerf curves and watch the animation. Now go the perspective view, select the master control and reset the rotation and translation. For better viewing, I create a surface plane. and rotate the body controller in x-axis. Now hide the nerf curves again and what's the follow through animation please download this rig file make your own follow through tail animation and enjoy if you learn something from my video please like and share and subscribe my channel thanks for watching